What's up, beautiful people? It's Regina Michelle, and I am here because I went to the thrift store and I want to show you all this haul I got. So let's go ahead and get into this haul. I'm going to show you all what I got. Now, you all know I do a lot of bread and butter items, a lot of bread and butter clothing, and most of these clothing will sell for at least $15 and up. So I went to a thrift store and they were having a 50% off sale off of everything in the store. So Everything that I got is not over $3, you guys. Some of it was a dollar, some of it was two. So let's go ahead and get into this first item. This first piece, y'all, I'm going to try to do some vintage dresses. Yes, because I don't find a whole lot of designer items. Now, vintage dresses, they do sell on eBay. Sometimes you may have to wait a while, but hey, they do sell. Look, it's the same color I got on. But y'all see this detail? Whoever had this dress, they really took care of it. See the buttons and things and the belt. Somebody is going to like this. And it's by Sarah Elizabeth. And it was $5.99, so I got it for $3. Might as well say $3. So that one, I saw it selling on eBay. And I saw one selling for about 20, so for about $25. Now what I do is I always put the item at least $20 or more. I try to put it high so the person can make me an offer so we can kind of meet in the middle. So I got another vintage dress. Like I told y'all, I don't find a whole lot of designer brands here in Alabama because I'm part-time. And so once I get to the thrift store, everything is gone. So what is this? Looks like Breely Originals and it's made in the US. USA. And it has the pleats. Would y'all would y'all wear this dress right here? I hate that it's missing the belt. It has a little belt thing here, but hopefully somebody will buy it. I might wear it myself. <laughs> Y'all know how I be seeing a lot of girls on here. They be restyling the dresses. I mean, the material feels good. I don't know if I can restyle that or not, but I do know I can resell it. Then I got these two denim skirts here. They were plus, plus size, 16W, 16 women's. I got two of these skirts. And whoever had these skirts, look like they didn't wear it. And look, $3.99, 50% off. Y'all do the math on that. But it's a long denim skirt. I saw these denim skirts now selling on eBay for at least $15 and up. And of course, y'all know, I'm a charge shipping. Two of them, y'all. And they were right by each other. I was like, thank you, Lord. $2 for this. And it's going to sell for at least $15 and up. But I'm going to place, I'm going to probably list this for about $18.99. And of course, like I say, I am going to charge shipping on it. Now this one, I did look up comps when I was in the store and I found this exact same blouse. It's um, Wranglers, let me find the tag. It's um, Rock, Rock by Wrangler. And it's a size extra large and it's the Pearl Snap. I didn't even make sure if it had all the pearls on here. But hopefully it do. Yeah, it has all the pearl snaps on it. And they're purple. I don't know if y'all can see the little pearl snaps on it. Yeah. So I'm going to list that. And I saw that they were selling for at least $18 and up. If I can find a picture on eBay, I'm going to put it in the description somewhere so you all can see it. So hopefully... This um, top will be in a what sold video. 
This is a Kathy Daniels sweater. Now I sold a yellow sweater like this by Kathy Daniels. I think it, I sold it for like $15 or more, but they do sell it. It stayed in my bins after I listed it probably about four to five months. So I'm pretty sure I can get at least $15 or more on this. Look at these buttons. But like I said, I'm going to list it for more and see if they can kind of meet me in the middle with it. And whoever had these clothes, y'all, look like they really did take care of them. This next item is a HD. I looked it up while I was in the store. It was $5.99 with 50% off, so about $3. Looks like it's an anthropology brand from where when I looked it up. Have you all ever saw this? HD. But when I touched the material, the material felt real good. And it it was, um, yeah, I know it's an anthropology because the RN says 66170. So that's how I always know if something is anthropology by that number that's in the tag. It'll say 66170. But I've never, I didn't know. I wouldn't have thought it was an anthropology brand because anthropology looks different to me than this. But it's just a flower dress. What size? It's a size medium. Looks look like I can wear it. Y'all think I should keep this? Nah, I don't really like this. This ain't my style right here. But somebody's going to like this. This is a plus size top by Dream. What is this? Dreams and Company. I saw somebody had sold this. It was selling on eBay. And it looks like it's new without tags. Look like whoever had this didn't wear it. Maybe somebody bought this for them for Christmas or something and they didn't like it. And they was like, I'm fixing to send this to the thrift store. But it's a 14, 16. And y'all, guess what? I was in the thrift store. This is the same thrift store I went to and donated some clothes. I saw my dress in there. They were selling it for, I think, $5.99. So I was like, look at my dress up in here. I'm going to see if I can put it in the description so y'all can see my dress. It's like, that's my dress. And then I got this Cold Water Creek. I wanted it for myself, but this Cold Water Creek, look, y'all see the little fish in it? in the like Aztec details like. I don't know what kind of detail you call this, but it's just a, a straight dress. I would, it's an extra large and it's so long. It's so long and I'm 5'2". And it would just drag the ground on me. But it's, it's very nice. And it stretches. So, look how pretty that is. I like little boho stuff like this. But hopefully, maybe I'll find one in my size. And I think this is an anthropology brand, too. It's called Skies. Skies are blue.
I like little dresses like this. I don't know what size this is. I think it's a medium. Yes, yeah, a medium. And I think this is anthropology. Let me see the RN on here. I'm going to have to look this up and see if this is anthropology or not. But I know this item does sell. I've sewn an item like this before. And hopefully it should go for at least $18 and up. It's cute. I'm scared to try it on because I may can't wear it and I'd be, be upset with myself. And so I'm not even going to try it on. I just never know. I'm either besides on some brands I can wear a medium, some brands that have to be a large. You just never know how the sizes are going to run. But I have got it thicker than a sneakers, y'all. So I don't got thick, thick delicious, but I'm working on it. I saw these little vintage glasses. It's, and it's three in here. And something told me to look the comps up on it. Cause sometimes, you know, people collect these kind of things. And it says, I have three. I have, y'all almost fell out the chair. I have three of these um, by Fresh. And I think they are like some vintage shrimp cocktail. Yeah, because it says shrimp cocktail. I don't know if this was a store or what, but it says fresh by Saucy 40. And I saw somebody had these. They had sold them for like $19, but they had um, six of these. Oh, y'all. I'm so crazy that it, it is six of them because the tape is right here. So it's six of them. So I can sell these for $19. I'm going to put it in the description so you all can see how the man sold his. I was wondering why mine looked different, but this is taped up so it comes off. And so it's half of this size. So it's really half of this size. Because I was wondering in the store, like when I saw the shrimp cocktail, I was like, I ain't never seen a shrimp cocktail thing that big, but that's what it is, you guys. So, And like I said, I got them for 99 cents, and y'all know what half of 99 cents is. So if I can sell that for $19, that's going to be a good little profit. And that little glass right there is not hard to ship because in the past, I was scared out of my mind to ship glass because I heard so many horror stories about it. But, so now y'all know I got to get these items listed. So I'm just going to do a little bit each day, do some pictures and measurements and do my listing and hopefully I can get it done. I'm trying to, um, to be a little bit more aggressive with my sales this year. Well, the year is almost over, but... <laughs> At this moment, I am trying to be a little bit more aggressive and make a little bit more money. But y'all let me know what y'all liked on this haul and what y'all think about some of these items that I have. And I hope you all have a great day. Y'all be blessed and shine bright.